Do we have a uh, conjecture for what's happening? Like what the result is? Or why? Or whatever you're seeing, the explore part. Yeah, the sum of the lanes will be passed. Sum of the lanes will be passed. Sum of the pinwheel equals half of the perimeter. So, the question becomes, can we prove that? <laughs> well, let's, let's try, let's try from just a triangle. So let's pretend like we have an equilateral triangle. Inside here, call it, call it D. And then I found perpendiculars to the edges. to rewrite our conjecture, symbolically, what would our rewrite be? about some things that you know from the picture. So it kind of, I mean, they kind of look, for example, the ones on the left here, mm -hmm. the XDA and XDB, those look pretty congruent. Mm -hmm. But these don't look so congruent, and these don't look so congruent, and these possibly be, could be congruent, but I'm not quite convinced of that. But I think, you know, drawing these pink lines, or line segments, that's, that may be the key to what we need to do next. Because what we're doing is now we're introducing new triangles that we can say new things about.
So now with this new picture that Roxy's provided us, what new things can we say? making these right triangles. So what can we say? What can we say about the picture at this point? The area of each of those triangles is one half the side plus the or times the height, which is the perpendicular. Can you write what you're saying, Kelly? Because I, I can't follow your words. You're all, we need, everybody needs to know what's going on. So, but, so, oh, what were you, what were you saying? saying? Um, let's see, I was saying, yeah. I think Kelly said, oh, uh, triangle. All right, everybody. Mm -hmm. So we have nice expressions for the areas of each of each of these that we can substitute in. Mm -hmm. What's what's the algebraic expression?
Same, so you could essentially just pick one thing, right, and name them all the same thing. 